today I'm going to do a video briefly about two purchases I made a few weeks ago almost about a month um, for those of you who know some people search this video um, exactly because they wanted to know about the product before they purchased it and some people may just watch it if they already just like scrolling through my channel or stumble across my channel either way hey how you doing thanks for coming to my channel um this is going to be a really quick video um i can be very long-winded so i'm going to try to snap out of it um so yeah for those of you who may or may not know adrian bylon holton a cast member of the daytime tv show the real recently created a small a uh, jewelry collection called XIXI. Uh, the line came out a few days before Black Friday, so back in November. Um, I saw it because it just got like that promo kind of post that everyone gets on their page for different products. Um, it popped up and I was like, oh, let me see what's going on. Saw the necklaces and the jewelry and I was just like, oh, this is really cute. So I thought I would give it a shot, especially because it was created by someone who's a little more well known that to me sometimes processes as it might be like good quality or if anything the customer service is good if i do have an issue so i was like all right let's try it um the collection was very small when it started i think they've added more pieces um as the months or weeks have gone on but originally it was four pieces it was two pendant necklaces, one choker, and one pair of hoop earrings. I opted to get two pendant necklaces. Um, I am Christian, um, so I love anything that has like a cross or a um, biblical figure just because, you know, I want people to know or not want people to know but it's something that I can wear and I'm like yes it supports my religion it's pretty you know I, I support it um, but anyone can wear it because some of the things are not religion based so it's like kind of good for everyone but ultimately I believe Adrian is Catholic so a lot of the pieces do have religious um, ties to them so I decided to get two necklaces. I got the prayer hand pendant necklace and I got the, I want to say it's called the Mi Familia um, pendant necklace, which basically is like a Virgin Mary. So I've been wearing the Virgin Mary more than anything um, just because of the length of it. You can see the Virgin Mary. I know it's probably like the light is super bright, but you guys can see is right here and it's actually double sided, which is always really good because when you're moving and your necklace flips around and moves, you still see the piece. Um, each item was $30. It was like $30 even for each item. They had a $5 shipping fee. So altogether it was like $65. Um, so it wasn't too bad. The only reason why I say it wasn't too bad is because I typically don't mind getting jewelry from like my local mall. I think they call it like a kiosk where they sell jewelry and things like that. I actually have a cross necklace that I've had for about a year and a half that I did coat with some clear polish and it's still holding up. It hasn't faded. It hasn't changed my neck. It hasn't caused breakout. So I don't sleep on... $30 jewelry stuff like that because the necklace the cross necklace that I have was $29.99 and with a little you know prayer and clear nail polish it's lasted for a really good time so I don't sleep on it so that's why when I saw the price for $30 I wasn't like $30 I was like oh, okay you know I've paid something close to that for other pieces um, of costume jewelry so I wasn't really like worried about it now, I really like the necklace. One, it's a really pretty gold pendant. Um, it has multiple class levels, I guess you can call it, or measurements, so it can hang a little lower. Um, the one thing I do like about the collection is she paid a lot of attention to detail. That's always really good, um, just because you're wearing it so much, um, or at least some people are, you wear it a lot, so you're like, you want it to, you know, have nice detailing, um, you know, just for them to pay attention to the small things. So, 
the first thing that I noticed was that the pendant was double-sided. That was like really great to me because I walk, I move around a lot when I'm at work. So sometimes you're wearing your necklace and it flips around and it's like, oh, I can't even see my necklace or people don't even see, can't even admire my necklace because it's all flipped to the backside. <laughs> so I thought that was really cool. It does have these little beads, which I think are really cute really simple it's a really simple necklace but the little things add more detail to it um and make it stand out a little bit more um and then on the back it has a little oh it's too bright uh, you can see it the xixi for the brand name and it's really cute now i am someone that does have sensitive skin so for me costume jewelry i almost always have to coat it with clear polish so it doesn't break my neck out and irritate my neck. And at the same time, nobody wants a green neck or wrist or finger or something like that because they've been wearing some cheap jewelry. Like, it's, it's levels to this. You got to know the, <laughs> the different tips and tricks to make stuff last and still look cute on a budget. So, you know, I was happy about that. Um, so, like I said, it was really nice. I actually wore this for three days in a row when I first purchased it just to see how it would work. I didn't coat it with anything and it did really well. As you guys know, it's winter time so it's cold. So even in November, it was a nice chill in the air where you had to have like your scarf, had a good jacket. So I was bundled up, hot, sweating when I took my stuff off when I came into work or came home. And typically that's when I start to get the most breakout because I have like fake jewelry on mixed with the, my body heat and sweating and it's, it normally causes a lot of irritation. This did not do that at all, so I was already a fan. I was like, yes. Um, so the Mi Familia pendant, the Virgin Mary pendant, whatever it is you wanna call it, I definitely support. Like I said, it's super cute. Let me put it on for you guys so you can see the length of it. And it's really cute. It holds up really well. No breakouts for me, someone with someone with really sensitive skin. So I support it. As you guys can see, it fits right here on that like uh, sternum. It falls right there. So really pretty, really nice. Um, no breakouts for me, someone with sensitive skin. So it's a plus. I'm wearing something that, you know, has a higher neck cut. But if you wore this with something that was a little deeper, it definitely will sit in a nice level and be pretty. And, you know, finish off any outfit or any piece like that. Um, so, like I said, the Me Familia pendant, I definitely support because it's just super cute. Um, it has an amazing figure on it. Um, I'm here for it. Now, when it came to this bag. When it came to the second necklace that I got, the praying hand pendant, um, I was a fan of it as well. But I did have a few issues, so I am going to explain that as well. Um, I got this necklace, all of these, well, these two pieces I got together. Um, this piece is a lot smaller or a lot shorter. Um, my issue with this necklace is that I had an issue with the spring that holds the necklace closed. Now, granted, I was able to wear it for a little bit, but it did fall off because if you guys can see, even when I let it go, let me show you, I pull it down and it stays open. You have to, well, at least with this necklace, I had to physically push it up for it to close which I don't think I should have to do. Um, it was like a defect, but I'll get into customer service and how they helped me out with this one. So it is a smaller necklace. If you can see right here, it definitely falls a little higher up, but that makes it better for layering, which is awesome to layer it with the praying um the me familiar necklace it's perfect so as you can see it has more of a twisted kind of braided chain um once again it's a double-sided piece and what i really like about this because i did not see originally when i looked at the purchase 
is that let me see oh but so bright okay if you can see it has little diamonds encrusted throughout the chain or throughout the pendant in the circle I thought that was really cute because originally when I saw this piece all I saw was the praying hands and the gold braid around it I didn't notice the diamond encrusted feature or detailing which I thought was so very cute it's so bright you guys okay hopefully you guys can see it a little better my hands are horrible you guys I have horrible skin on my hands um <laughs> but as you can see it's really pretty nice and shiny you know it looks cute it looks like you got a little money you look like you're worth a hundred quarters hundred quarters not a hundred dollars a hundred quarters something like you know a little money not too much um <laughs> but it's really cute really simple but it still makes that statement um you know it's not something that's too heavy and too gaudy even though it has little fake little diamonds encrusted it still looks really nice um very simple but it looks like it's a little expensive so that's why i was a fan of it now my issue that came in timing shipping was really fast um i ordered it on a friday um, and I actually got the order that next Wednesday. So timing was really fast um, or shipping was really fast. The products came exactly what I ordered. No issue, no fuss, no misplacing my package. I was able to come home to it and I was really excited about it. The only downfall was that I did receive a broken spring. Um, definitely something that if you just take the time, you could definitely deal with it. But luckily, the reason why I was able to get it on today is because I don't have my nail extensions. For those of you who don't know, which is everybody, um, <laughs> I'm in school to become a licensed nail technician. So typically, I always do have extensions on. Um, but I did take them off because I had to braid my hair underneath this because i created a wig unit so i can't really do braiding with nails so i have to have my natural fingers and nails out so i can grip my hair so that's the only reason why i've kind of prolonged my process of putting nails on because i knew i had like a hair kind of situation going on um now calling customer service there's no number there's just an email i emailed them waited a few days didn't hear anything um i messaged them on their instagram page still didn't hear anything so i was very disappointed um it wasn't until i filed a claim with paypal just because i wanted to exchange it for a, a necklace with the class or spring that worked um that's what i wanted to do um and it wasn't until I reached out through PayPal that someone finally got back to me almost two weeks later. Um, they asked me, you know, what the issue was to send them pictures. And it was funny because the communication that I finally received was very fast and back to back. So they messaged me. I messaged them back a few minutes later, messaged me. It just was like a back and forth conversation which i did like once i got a hold of customer service but in the beginning it was a very long process of me waiting to hear back from someone so that was a bummer but once i did speak with someone they asked me what i wanted to do and originally i did want another just to swap it out give them the, the broken one and receive a new one because i really did enjoy it or I was a fan of it. Um, after not hearing back from someone, I was like, I'd rather just return it and get a refund. Um, they were like, no, it's okay. Just take this refund. Excuse me, y'all. I'm such a lady. That's how I'm going to get a husband. He going to be like, girl, I heard you burp across the room and I was hugged. I'm gonna be like, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I just asked, I was like, I prefer a refund. They gave me the refund with no issue. I was like, okay. So yeah, I was a little happier. Um, so if you are looking for simple jewelry, yes. If you're looking for something that's backed by someone that we kind of know from TV, go for it. If customer service is a big thing to you where if you have an issue and you don't have time to wait and you want to speak with someone, 
eh, eh, I don't know. I don't know if you want to, you know, <laughs> go down this road. But if you are someone who doesn't mind the weight, knowing that you are going to get a good payoff, then go for it. Uh, last thing I wanted to talk about was the packaging. They come in these really cute boxes. Packaging is really everything now, so I definitely appreciate this packaging. And I also like it because the book packaging is magnetic. So um, once you close it, it's closed. You can still store your jewelry in here if that's what you want, or you can get rid of it or whatever. Totally up to you. Um, but I thought that was so cute because it was times where... I was, when you have your jewelry inside, it keeps it placed in the center, I feel like, because it's magnetic. Who knows? I don't know. I'm not a scientist. I could be making stuff up. Um, but the packaging is really cute. It's a very pretty marble um, color. <sighs> okay, excuse me. Um, <laughs> a very pretty marble aesthetic. Um, when you open it up, it does have a little quote. Through life's many adventures, never forget to cherish where you come from. Collect memories like treasures and take them with you everywhere you go. XO, XO, Adrian. So, it's really cute. All of the boxes say the same thing. Um, but it, it's just really cute. Packaging is just is really pretty. So, when you get the item, it comes in a regular brown box with your packages. And they're very pretty and stylish marble aesthetic and then you get a cute little card with adrian Milon. if you guys can see she is rocking her necklaces in the layered style so that's why it's really cute to get them together because they lay perfectly with one another um and so it's just her thank you card on the back it says thank you from the bottom of my heart for your love and support Thank you for making my dreams come true with XIXI. I put my heart and soul into this collection. Each one of these pieces was made with love. Hope you love it as much as I do. Can't wait to see how you rock it. Use the hashtag, hashtag XIXI, hashtag Faith and Familia. So, really cute pieces. Aesthetics, you know were really taken into consideration with this um overall i'm a fan of it um i think it was definitely worth the money 30 dollars um but then i got a little you know i didn't pay the whole 80 the 60 dollars i did but then i got refunded because of the issue um <laughs> but you know see i had to try to clip it back up um but i think it's definitely worth the buy um i think quality style is definitely there like i said the only thing that i care about is the customer service definitely could be a little better just with their timing because depending on if you're getting this as a gift for someone else um or whatever you don't have time to just like you know be waiting for someone to get back to you for like two weeks so as you can see, it fits perfectly. If I was to have gotten the choker, that would fit. It's really cute. I support it. If you are looking for more of the collection and want to see a little more, head over to Adrian Bailon's Instagram or the XIXI Instagram to get more information. And I believe they did have a sale for Christmas. Um to get like 25% off or buy one get one half off so definitely check it out I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm going to try to continue to make more and more and more um in the next video I'm going to make are actually going to be about these glasses that I got from an online store called glasses USA so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you later bye